You know what? soon. Hey, what should I bring if I'm running away from home? I need lots of snacks, right? And my insurance card? Really? Wow! Running away is easier than I thought. Now, just gotta decide when to sneak out. Give it a try. Don't worry, I'll be just fine, okay? I'm gonna miss playing with you, though. What's wrong? You all hungry or something? Mm, not really. Uh, 
Um... You know, it's almost summer break. Oh, yeah. It is, huh? Does anyone have any plans? I wish I could go to the beach. Hot sand, cool breeze, <laughs> babes in bikinis. Man, a break like that sure would be nice. Somewhere in the south, where the water is crystal clear. But starting tomorrow, we gotta get through our exams. Oh man, this sucks. I'm sure you'll be fine. But it would be nice to go somewhere with beautiful beaches, like Okinawa. Well, it's not Okinawa, but how about Yakushima? Mr. Chairman, I didn't realize you were here. I happen to be in the area, so I thought I'd drop by and tell you my schedule for next week. Oh, Hirinjoku, your father will be vacationing in Yakushima during the break. He... he will? You'll all have some time off after exams, right? Why don't you go and get a nice change of scenery? Seriously? We're gonna go on a trip? Yes! Beaches and bikinis! Beaches and bikinis! Beaches and bikinis? The sky. <laughs> How about it, Hirijoku? Well, my father is a busy man. I don't want to ruin his vacation. <laughs> Why so hesitant? No father would be upset with a daughter who came all that way to see him. You've all done a great job. You deserve to relax for a while. And we already know when the next operation will be, so I think it'll be fine. I don't know. Senpai, I'm begging you. <laughs> all right. I guess everyone needs a break now and then. Let's do it. The beach, huh? <laughs> I should design a special training regimen. Oh man, I can't wait! Oh, I need to go buy a swimsuit. Hey, don't worry. I got one you can borrow. Nice try. Are you going to swim too, Mr. Chairman? I'm afraid I can't. I'll turn to dust if I'm exposed to sunlight. Wait, seriously? Don't be stupid. <laughs> Kirijo Senpai, wait up! Uh, I just wanted to say sorry about the other day. I might have gotten a little carried away. Don't worry about it. In a way, it's only logical that we go to Yakushima. The chairman said that no one who was responsible for the accident survived, but there is one who did. What? There is? My father. I had no idea.
Ja. Ja. I'm fine helping out with studying, but wouldn't it be easier to focus without the distraction? They say studying with others grants benefits that can't be found alone. Hey, so if we flunk the exams, are we really gonna have to stay behind? Tell me that's a joke. It's no joke. As students, studying is our top priority. Failure will result in consequences. Well, I'm not too worried about that. Not naming names here, but don't get in the way, Junpei. What happened to not naming names? Uh, I guess if the fate of my trip depends on it, I don't really have a choice. I'll show you. I'll prove just how serious I am about Yakushima. What's the matter? Something you need help with? Old English verb conjugation differs from modern day. For example, you are becomes thou art. Oh my! Remembering how to use archaic forms of verbs sounds rather intense. Uh, intense. I like the sound of that one. Keeping a note of that. Wisecracks from June Pay are one thing. I didn't account for this. Maybe he's trying to test our ability to concentrate? Uh, yeah, I suppose that's not likely. Hmm. Mikutsuki sounds one up in me. I gotta think of a killer comeback. Stop getting distracted. You need to concentrate on your studies. She's right. Gotta focus. Let's keep at it. Are you struggling with memorization? Nothing beats repeating it until you know it by heart. Beats? Heart? <laughs> Not bad, Kirijo-kun. What? No, that, that was not my intent with that statement. Well, if you're pulling out of the race, then I win, hands down. Kirijo Senpai defeated. Ugh, this is giving me a headache. Despite the diversions, I'd say that was productive. Keep it up so we can all go to Yakushima together.
Elizabeth speaking. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. I thought it prudent to inform you. Well then, I wish you a safe journey. Question. Whatever. A real man doesn't dwell in the past. I'm already thinking ahead to the blue skies of Yakushima. Oh yeah, that's coming up soon, huh? Are you all ready to go? Me? Uh, not really. Sorry, I don't sound very enthusiastic, do I? Hey, how about we stop somewhere on the way back? I don't have practice today. Sounds good. Where are we going? If you need to buy a swimsuit, I'd be happy to help. <laughs> very funny. All right, give me a sec. I'm gonna go grab my stuff from the locker room. Oh, I'll invite Fuka too. Hey, uh, I know I've been kind of a dick lately. So, uh, sorry about that. <laughs> All right, let's put this whole thing behind us. Cool? All right, let's get out of here. Will you? You bounce back from things so quickly, Junpei kun. You know it. Oh, hey, Sonata san's here. Don't see that every day. Ikutsuki san called me. I think he wants to talk about a new candidate. Does that mean another person is going to join? Maybe. Fuka. What's wrong, Natsuki-chan? Do you think you can stay after school with me for a mandatory study session? There's like no one. Oh wait, are you about to head out for the day? Okay then, never mind. Wait! It's alright, I'll help you. Sorry, I'll see you all back at the dorm later. I'm really surprised at how much she's changed. Ah, friendship. How beautiful. Adolescence is such a wonderful thing. So full of vibrancy. Mr. Chairman? Oh, hello. I just stopped by to pick someone up. I might as well introduce you to him now. <laughs> hello. Oh, Amonakun. What are you doing here? You know him? He doesn't leave during the break because of his circumstances. Oh, I heard about that. 
Something about your parents, right? It used to only be me and my mom. She got in an accident. So now it's just me. It happened two years ago. Right now, one of his distant relatives is paying for his school expenses. But that doesn't mean he should stay at the elementary school dorm all by himself, right? So I decided to move him to your dorm, just for the summer. <laughs> to our dorm? Do you really think that's a good idea? Why, of course. He has the potential. Then he's the new candidate? That's right. But as you can see, he's still just an elementary school student, so it's only a possibility for now. Are you Akihiko Sonata Senpai? Uh, yeah. I've heard a lot about you. You've never lost a boxing match. Nice to meet you. Um, yeah, nice to meet you. at a good time. There are some new items you can create. Are you sure? Here you go. Thanks for waiting. I'm sure this will prove to be useful. There are other people who can use personas, right? Try to get along with them. You've got a good eye. Did that catch your eye? We have a deal. Go on, look around. You like that one? 
Did that catch your eye? All right, I'll trade you for this. Everything good? Hope to see you soon. I'm looking forward to it. Here are my requests. Let's hear the results. A shame. Oh my, you've already fulfilled the requirements. Oh my. Marvelous. <laughs> Very well, then. Good day. I shall be waiting then. Very well then. lesson is called, the smaller the dog, the louder the bark. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to see through people's bathing suits at the beach? My! I don't think I've ever seen you this enthusiastic. Consumers might be persuaded by such candor. We could position you as the boy next door. Our company ran an ad in uh, adult magazines proposing a special filter for digital cameras. Simply attach it to your camera and voila! Start peeping! Undress them with your camera's eye, it says. It's been selling like hotcakes. In fact, it's our number one seller. Unfortunately, customers have been complaining that it doesn't work. I told my staff to just ignore them. Nowhere does it guarantee that you'll be able to see anything. What are they gonna do? Tell everyone their creepy plan didn't work out? <laughs> Sorry, bucko. By the way, try to cut back on the donuts and cupcakes, huh? I have an idea for an ad campaign. Women would go crazy over a handsome young man in swim trunks. You'd be perfect for the job.
have you been keeping your promise? You didn't tell anyone, did you? If you go back on your word, I'll edit your face into the most obscene material I can find. I'm going to do it. Good, good. Not bad, kid. Thanks, kid. I've been waiting for you. <sighs> Flowing stairs that pose an obstacle to those who dare to reach another floor. So, this is an escalator. A simple contraption at first glance. But one false step will leave one mired in an exhausting ordeal. To all customers, for your own safety and the safety of others, please do not move in the opposite direction of the escalators. Thank you. Oh my. It seems that these customers may come to harm. We'd best exercise caution ourselves. And what is this? Please watch your step. There is a pitfall just ahead. Why, 
it's right over here. There, in the center of this fenced-off area. It's marked with eye-catching signs, proclaiming in bold print, do not enter. Humans are frequently drawn to what has been forbidden. This is a crafty snare, one that defies the common notion that pitfalls must be hidden. Flowing stairways, pitfalls employing high-level psychological tactics. Human authorities truly go to great lengths in their quest to preserve the town's law and order. I'm very moved by their dedication to the cause. Let us carry on. Our thoughts with the unsung heroes who give their love and lives to this town. Oh! This tantalizing fragrance. Can it be? Whoa! You can figure out our secret ingredient with just a whiff? I guess you got a funky sense of smell to go with your funky sense of style, lady. Well, there ain't a law saying takoyaki shops can't cook other stuff besides octopus. So, how about it? Want to buy some? I swear my takoyaki is so good it'll make your jaw drop. Cuisine so scrumptious that one's jaw can drop off? I imagine that would warrant urgent medical care, realistically speaking. But I would very much like a taste. Unfortunately, this is all I have on me at the moment. I do hope this is sufficient. I have yet to see someone who has actually lost their jaw. That must mean that the ordinary citizen cannot easily afford these. Oh, upon closer inspection, a single serving is only 400 yen. Well then, two orders of your finest takoyaki, please. Thanks. Here you go. And come again. This distinct texture, the firm, chewy skin. There's no doubt about it. I must say, I'm surprised to see this used as a cooking ingredient. The human mind. It is cursed to forever retain whatever knowledge it gains, whether good or ill. Forgive my reticence, but some questions are better left unanswered. <sighs> there appear to be several dining establishments around here. We must simply visit all of them. My first priority is to go to something called a net cafe, where one may use something called a soda fountain. This apparatus allows for an infinite combination of flavors by mixing various solutions. Just thinking about it gives me a sort of electric tingle across my tongue. <sighs> I see. My, oh my. Oh, how intriguing. We appear to have exhausted every dining option in this area. Oh dear, is something the matter? Now that I think about it, you haven't eaten much since our seventh meal. In any event, I must thank you for your delightful company. I shall certainly savor this experience. If you don't mind. I'd very much appreciate it if you were to escort me again sometime. Here are my requests. Wonderful. Marvelous. <laughs> 
Very well, then. doing so well lately, you know? And it's all because of your blasphemy. I baked so hard for your soul that I think I actually lost weight. Look at me! I'm paper thin now! Damn straight! I could down a ham katsu in my sleep if I really wanted to! I get what you're trying to say. You're embarrassed to be seen with me, right? I'm not like my little brother. I'm not smart or athletic, and I have weird stubby legs. And my pants are covered with food stains. I'm just a thorn in everyone's side. They all wish I could be more like my little brother. All they do is make fun of me. I just want this whole world to disappear. But the world can't end yet. Not until I save you first. Look, I can try harder. I just need to make it to paradise. That should solve all my problems. I'll be taller and more slender, and my body will glow. So I'll be safer at night. See? Then I won't be inferior to my brother. And you won't hate being seen with me. So please, don't abandon me. to go, so I don't have time to eat today. I haven't earned forgiveness just yet. And I have to find a new member to recruit soon. That was him just now. So can handle it. Yeah, all I gotta do is rough him up and I get paid. You know, I've got this buddy who's kind of strapped for cash, too, if you catch my drift. Fine, you both get paid. Just make sure you finish the job. Huh? Oh, it's you. 132,000 yen, right? That's the same trick he used on my son. If you know what's good for you, Stay the hell away from him. Nighttime alone, the sun on one, any time surprise. 
Where we will choose.